Hey guys, so I'm about to leave for a trip, so that's why this video is going to be really short, really concise to the point, but the Rise of Titans trailer just came out and I really want to react to it before I leave, so here we go. Super excited. It's 2 minutes and 31 seconds, and I wasn't sure if I was going to watch it, but I'm not going to be able to avoid spoilers because I follow literally everyone on the TOA Twitter, so let's just go watch this. Uh oh! Oh shoot! Between mankind and magic. Yeah! What? Yeah! Yeah! Oh, Christ, that's awesome! The animation looks a little bit different. What are we dealing with? Oh my gosh! Oh. I'm getting chills, man. I'm getting chills. Let's go. Trolls. Aliens. With robots. Yes, yes. Can I keep it? And take it to school. Giant Rex. Blinky. Nothing can stop us. Oh my gosh, they all look so beautiful. Whoa. Hey! I knew I shouldn't have taken that bathroom break. Oh shoot. Oh. <laughs> Oh, everyone's back! Everyone's back! Oh my gosh! Wait, are you doing that hero's bitch thing? I love the hero's bitch thing! <laughs> oh, Duxie! <laughs> Stop it! Oh my gosh! Toby. Oh man, there's so much. Oh, I, oh. In there that I want to just go over. Okay, really quick. Everyone's back. Everyone's back. Everyone from all the series. We got Namur and Strickler. We got Stuart. We got Krell and Aja and everyone there. Oh gosh, that oh, that's gonna be so exciting. Yes, yes. And I can't tell the the animation style looks a little bit different. Like, tell me I'm not wrong. I feel like that's definitely a thing. Like it's it's partially different. And I don't know if it's just me, if it's just because it's like more detailed. Um, or if it's like more contrasted, because I saw the poster and that looks pretty contrasted. But um, we got Steve. I didn't see Eli in there. I hope Eli's coming back. I assume he is because it's probably going to be everyone. And I don't know how they're going to fit this all into two hours. It honestly looks like it could be a four hour movie and even then it would be pushing its luck. But um, that's going to be super exciting either way. Ah, I'm so excited. Dixie's back and everyone's back and Jim was beautiful and he's all the next caliber. That was absolutely amazing. I am so hyped for the freaking, um, I'm so hyped. I'm just super hyped for the movie to come out. And unfortunately, since I'm in a rush, I can't do like the whole comparison thing. Maybe I'll do one when I get back. If so, it'll be right here. So the question now is if Nari, cause there's clearly, there's the ice, there's the ice frost giant. There's the uh, fire one that's controlled by Belrock. So I can only assume that the other one's controlled by Skrell. Um, but then, I can't imagine Nari as a willing participant unless it is in the past. But well, that wouldn't make sense. So probably not. But uh, then we have to wonder if Nari is being controlled, possibly, or something. I don't know. But our first look at the Fire Titan is super cool. Like the full thing. Gosh, that is so freaking cool. I love that it's lava pouring from him. Sick. Sick. And then the. Uh, the Earth one actually kind of reminds me a little bit of, um, you guys know uh, Shadow of the Colossus. 
kind of reminds me of something from that and that game was really freaking awesome so that just makes me excited i love this design it's kind of like a spider it kind of looks like a spider creature because the way it's walking or you know like four-legged beast um it's it's nice and i'm glad they didn't just go like with the typical you know oh this is a panther or something like that they actually went with just a new design in general and i love that I don't know if it's the lighting, like if they chose a different lighting or something, but Toby looks way more contrasted here. Definitely more interesting for sure. But he's our lovable Tobe. So this is either Hextech that they're at or because the table sort of looks, you know, ancient. Um, or it's possible that it's also some sort of Acridian place. But I have a feeling that this is either Hextech or uh, maybe Merlin's old tower or something. I, I don't know. Because it has a mix of, you know, the futuristic technology, but it also kind of has that old castle-y look, ruin look, so that's my guess anyways. Strickler's back in his complete troll form, which is interesting. It'll be cool because it looks like we're going to have a lot of different world settings and things like that, and so taking place in different areas. I don't know. It's a city, so I assume that it could be New Jersey. Maybe. That's a possibility. And Aja here looking like a queen. Ah, oh, she's so pretty, especially in her upgraded armor. Like, she just looks so much more regal and professional, just like her parents. Ah, I love her. And it looks to me here that maybe... I can't tell if that's Stuxy's magic that's holding Krell to the rock or to the uh, the creature or or what's going on, but Clara has to come in and save him. Aja and Varvatos! Yes! Look at those weapons! Yeah! Rock it, guys! Rock it! Knock him out of the park! It's gonna be so good to see the Acheridian tech more. I really enjoyed that about Three Below and it'll be nice to see, you know, more of it and how it works and different aspects of it. Cause we, we got to see some of it with like Mothership and when we were on Acheridian 5, but we didn't get to see, you know, a ton of it. I, free I freaking love that Varvatos is gonna be manning a mech against this thing. It's gonna be like Evangelion up in here. I'm sorry, that's the only mech anime I really know of besides Lauren and Gar Gar and Lauren. <laughs> but it's it's gonna be freaking awesome to see some giant epic mech powered fights. Yeah, that'd be great. Especially because Varvatos is already a powerhouse, so it'd be interesting to see what him inside a giant mech would be able to do. You know, this this screenshot actually worries me. It looks like a heartfelt mole, but to me, it also looks like Blinky's injured like maybe beyond that scratch and that worries me because Blinky's my favorite character and if they try to kill him I will be very upset. <laughs> and Blinky, when we, we come together and it looks like here Jim is battling against Bellrock. No armor though for Jim, that's interesting. I thought that there would be, um, especially considering that one screenshot, but maybe that's later on? Possibly? I don't know. Aja in a spaceship. Oh, that's so cool. She's gonna use it to totally kick butt. Jim looks absolutely beautiful. Just look at his eyes. Oh my gosh. They really like put on an extra layer of detail for this movie and I'm all about it. Stop falling home. And interesting, in this one, the stone is missing and in a previous shot, Jim was holding the stone for the uh, Excalibur. So I really am not sure like what's going on with that. Maybe that's what gives it the power and he decides to give that to Duke C to make his armor or who knows, who knows? Because it is green, Art of Merlin's magic maybe? Leftover magic, I don't know. That could be, maybe. And Duke C with his staff, yeah! It makes me so happy, look at him! Look at him, look at him, look at him. Ah, oh, I'm so proud of him. I'm so happy for him. I'm so proud. I feel like a proud baron. Oh gosh, I just, I can't. I freaking, I love Dukes so much. His whole story, he deserves, he, wizards deserve so much better than a god. Just saying, I love it. I freaking love it. It's so good, it's so good. And he's still as charming self as ever. Ah. <laughs> oh no, he's so funny. I, lo I love it, just good. I love that he can be as old as he is, yet still have that like youthful, joyous jokesterness about him. That's great. Oh, wait, I just saw the armor. Hold up. Okay, so the armor does manifest on him during the fight with Belrock. That's probably a spoiler, but you know, these trailers love to spoil everything. So 
That's still pretty cool. It's good to see him in armor again. Oh, it's so pretty. People were speculating it's gonna be a mix of Acarity and Tech and Duxie's magic, and I'm all about that. I'm all about that. Yes, please. It is still super exciting. Oh, I'm just so ready. So thank you guys for watching this, and I hope you're all looking forward to the movie as much too as I am. I know I need to rewatch everything so I can remember everything. And yeah, I gotta get going now. So I'll see you guys all in the next video that we do around here. Peace guys.